In a half-occupied Long Beach, California community center, volunteers consider three-hour service each day like a holiday. It's like Christmas because, you know, you know on Christmas you always get your package and you're like, oh my gosh, I want to open it up and everything. Because they preside over a treasure trove of clothes, accessories, knickknacks, and books. Like here, we just got these binoculars donated. You know, I mean, they're a little beat up, they're a little warm, but I'm pretty sure they work just fine. And they give them away. Inventory is always changing. Every single time I come here to volunteer, there's a whole bunch of new stuff. It's very, very popular. Uh, you'd be surprised. I mean, people bring all kinds of things here. Hello, welcome to the free store. Have you been here before? At most, all a shopper has to do is donate things or time to the free store. Come in. They'll come in with, uh, let's say they come in with four items. And they, uh, they we sign them in, we get their email address and their name. It's tax deductible. And they, if they come in with four items, they can leave with four items. It all works by taking in more than they give away. Plus, everyone here works by donating their time. But if you have nothing to give, you won't walk away empty-handed. If they don't come in with any item, they can uh, always come in and they're welcome to take two items. The organizers of the free store, a nonprofit called the Catalyst Network, say they think they can grow the store. They've generated regulars in the month since it's been open. We picked up like some math books the first day. and It's a really inspirational thing that's going on, and I think that more people should be able to use other forms of currency other than just dollar bills. You know, a favor for a favor is really, really great. And with California mired in double-digit unemployment, this one store may be just a beginning of something bigger. John Bone Associated Press, Long Beach, California.